Leila from Pakistan says, what do we do when we get sprinkles from uh, uh, answering the call of nature? And we feel there is a difference between actual uh, um, ricochet, if you may say, that comes from impurities to your thighs, to your body, to your back, and if it's actually happening. A feeling is different than what actually happens. Feelings are not cer certainty. And if I have a feeling that this has a drop of urine on it, I can't see it, I can't smell it, how do I claim that this is impure just because of a feeling? No, this doesn't work like that. Likewise, when a person defecates or urinates and he feels that there are splashes, can he see them? Can he touch and feel them? If the answer is yes, then he has to wash it off. If the answer is no, then this is from shaitan. Some people come to me and say, Sheikh, while sitting on the toilet seat, urinating, I feel that there are wetness in the back of my head. I say, this even defies physics. If you hold something like this pen and the distance between it and the surface of the water and you drop it, would the drop reach the place it was dropped from or it would exceed it? I don't know, I don't, I, I'm, I'm very bad in physics. But logically, it can't reach this high when it freely flows or freely falls on a surface of the water. To go that high up, we can generate energy because we're not using anything except gravity. And gravity cannot push up. It pulls down. So you have to be certain in order to implement the rule of washing it off. Otherwise, the rule remains. Certainty is not affected by doubt.